CIA spies the environment, Whole Foods CEO denies climate change and toxic monkeys in Nepal. This is Planet 100. Welcome to Planet 100, the top environmental news stories of the day in 100 seconds or less. I'm Sarah Backhouse and it's Thursday, December 7th. While much attention has been on the CIA's recent failure to thwart a terror attack, the intelligence organisation have been quietly relaunching a new initiative, spying on polar ice sheets. The MEDEA program, or Measurements of Earth Data for Environmental Analysis, was recently revived by Washington to give environmental scientists access to classified intelligence satellites as they pass over the polar regions of the Earth. Born during the Clinton years, the MEDEA program was shut down by the Bush administration. But as the Pentagon recently deemed climate change a national security threat, it's likely the program will continue. Now over to Catherine Goldstein for Webvine. Thanks, Sarah. This week, the internet is abuzz about Whole Foods CEO John Mackey. Again. It turns out, according to The New Yorker, he's a global warming skeptic. This is not the first time Mackey has ignited controversy. Most recently, this summer, he came out against health care reform, and progressives were furious. The debate about Mackey is going strong here on HuffPost. Waylon Lewis blogged about it for us with over a thousand comments so far. Treehugger, Mother Jones, and others have picked up on the story. I'll be watching the unfolding blogosphere reaction. Thanks, Catherine. And finally, scientists in Kathmandu, Nepal, are using monkeys as sentinels for urban toxicity. Using hair samples, researchers found that toxins like lead are more prevalent in the younger animals than the older ones. And that's the Planet 100. See you tomorrow for more breaking news.